Okay, you already hear the joke about pink ping pong balls? Yeah, uh... Okay, so there's this kid, right? Just turned 13. And he's, he's a really, really rich father. So he's a really rich family. And the father tells the kid, you can get anything you want for your birthday. Anything in the world I will get for you. And he asks, for one pink ping pong ball. The father says, are you sure I can get you anything in the world? The son says, one pink ping pong ball. So, he gets him one pink ping pong ball. He takes it with, takes it with him to bed. In the morning, the father comes in to wake him up. The pink ping pong ball is gone. Next year. <laughs> That's 14. Uh, the kid asks, uh, the father says, yeah, father says, your birthday again, get you anything you want for your birthday. The kid says, I want a room full of pink ping pong balls. The father says, I can get you anything you want. It says, one room full of pink ping pong balls. So, he gets him a room full of pink pong, pink ping pong balls. He goes to sleep, leaves him for the night. The father comes back. The room full of pink pong pong balls is gone. Can you ready for this? Do this. Wait, get out. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Stand in the back. Oh, stand the back? Okay. Ignition! <laughs> Alright. You get to drive. Just drive around. Because now the kid is 15. Next birthday. And the father tells him again, you can get anything you want for your birthday. And he asks, I want a warehouse full of pink ping pong balls. The father <coughs> says, okay, I will get you a warehouse full of pink ping pong balls. And he leaves his son there for the night. He comes back next morning. All the pink ping pong balls are gone. There are no pink ping pong balls to be found. Next year, another birthday, the father tells the son, you can get anything you want for your birthday. The son says, I want a cargo ship of pink ping pong balls. The father says, are you sure? The son says, yes. So the father says, I will get you. A cargo ship of pink ping pong balls. So he leaves him on the ship. The father comes back the next day, and all of the pink ping pong balls are gone. Is he like ingesting them, like putting them in his butt? Like what's happening? Next year, the father says, "I'll get you anything for your birthday," and the son says, "I want." A factory of pink ping pong balls. And the father says, I will get you that factory of pink ping pong balls. A pink ping pong ball factory. So he's in there for the night. They're making pink ping pong balls. Making them by a lot. Comes back the next morning. All the pink ping pong balls are gone, and all the supplies to make pink ping pong balls have been completely deplenished. So, it's his 18th birthday. And the father says, this is the last time I will ever get you whatever you want for your birthday. From now on, you will be self-sufficient. And then... Boy asks, 
I want a bay full of freighters, full of pink ping pong balls. And the father says, are you sure this is the last time I will ever get you anything you want for your birthday? And the son says, yes, I am sure. That is what I want. And the father says, I will get you those pink ping pong balls. He comes back the next day. Every single ship. Completely empty. There are no pink ping pong balls to be found. Next year. Boy is 19. The boy is very sick. He's going to die soon. And the father asks him and tells him, I will get you for your last gift. Anything you want. And the son asks, I have just one pink ping pong ball. And the father says, Yes. But on the condition that you tell me what you did with all of those pink ping pong balls. And the son says, okay. So he comes back, gives him one pink ping pong ball, and leaves him for the night. Comes back next morning, the pink ping pong ball is gone. And then he asks, where did all of those pink ping pong balls? And then, the son dies. You just wasted so much time. <laughs> yep, that's the joke. <laughs> Do I have to walk home? <laughs> <laughs> oh, Mr. Biggie left. No. <laughs> It doesn't matter. I don't know. <laughs> the whole joke is the fact that he dies before he can tell you. Why are we even friends? Why would you do that to me? I love you. Sitting here for like a good like <laughs> 10 minutes. Okay. You wondering eight. what's happening to these ping pong balls. And then he dies! <laughs>